What's going on, everybody? DJ Goham here. We made money! $14,000 in sold milk, 11000 running costs, yada, 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 down the list, down the list. We didn't lose money. Yes! I do know for a fact we are going to have to clean up. Wow, you can't see a darn thing in here, can you? Here we go. Wow, too far. <laughs> If you get these CSZ uh, packs, the CSZ pack stuff, uh, yeah, they're they're out there. Let's take a look at our aminals. Cleanliness is down. Health is up. And there's a whole lot of straw in there. <laughs> Some tells me we could have done with one straw bell. But you know what? I don't care. Oh, it's not that bad. I did clean them up before I went to bed last night. So, so we can get this just right. This grass thing, it really did not want to behave last time I was using it. But it did work. And that's all we care about. Hello, little baby cow. What's going on? Moo moo to you two. Hey -o. <laughs> He's looking up like, oh, what are you doing, man? All right, so these guys have some poo and they need to be mucked out. Part of the cleanliness. I wish it wasn't, but it is what it is, and there's nothing we can do about it. They have poo, and we need to get it out. Actually, I guess we'd probably just run through an hour and see if the cleanliness goes up. If the cleanliness goes up, well, it doesn't really matter about the poo, then does it? But we got to find somewhere to put the poo anyway. Um, we need to put it somewhere not at the house. So, will this take manure? If that'll take manure then I know exactly where I'm putting the poo. Do 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 where am I going? Yeah. <laughs> uh, I don't see manure on there anywhere. Um isn't there a manure like I know there's a cell point. Is there a way to store it? Let's see. Mm, can't put it in there. Don't think I can put it. <laughs> definitely can't put it in there. So, wood chip storage. It's slurry. I don't think we can store it anywhere. And that kind of stinks a little bit. But I gotta put it somewhere. Maybe we should buy a trailer for it. We're not gonna use it. We're gonna sell it. Is that 36, 46? Those are Brantners. Those are definitely not USA compatible. You know, one thing we could do, we could have the Goham Co. bring us a tipper thing. One of these things. Oh, that's all. That hold 40. That hold 45. Holds like 48. A. 48, that might be what we go with. What do we have right now? How long do we think it's going to take to fill up? Manure, 3,000. Okay, good to know. Um, yeah, we could get one of those. Let's uh, let's give Goham Co. a call and have them bring us a tipper thang. And we're just going to put it over here. And we'll just load the manure in it when we get it. Sweet! Should probably move this first. This is kind of in the way. Yeah, there we go. Big shout out to Goham Co. for bringing us a sweet tipper. Uh, it didn't cost too much, it was about 20 grand. We did pay for it. We had to pay for the tipper. They said, we're not giving you something to put poo in just for it to go nasty bad. So we're going to start with this. We're going to see. I have seen many, many videos of people with, uh, <laughs> well, with this. Not with this tipper. But with manure on this, on this uh, map. And it's pretty ridiculous. So I'm hoping that we don't get so ridiculous. Now we are going to put the manure thing right here. I wasn't really sure where I wanted to put it, but this seems to be the best place for it. And simply detach and bring the arm back in. 
There we go. We'll get this truck returned in a minute. Thank you, Goham Co., for letting us borrow that. And we got you. Oh, I got grass out already. Uh, you know what? I ain't doing it. I ain't your mama. <laughs> Open that. Open that. Nice. And in we go. Now, like I said, we only have about 3,000 liters of manure in here. Um, I'm not sure if we can get it all in one scoop or not. I'm going to try. I don't think we can. We're going to find out if we can or not. Um, nope. Can't get it all. But we're able to get almost all of it. Hello, baby cow. How are you doing today? I have your poo. <laughs> and we've got this. Simply bring it out here. Hopefully we don't hit anything. Because if we hit anything, we are done for. And this is something we're going to have to do every day. Oh, no, no, no. None of it went in the trailer. No, all the poo's on the ground. i got to clean it up. Oh, God. Gosh, how does something like that happen? Uh, I've got it all now. I've got it all again. It goes in here, not... I don't know what just happened, but it all went on the ground. Here we go. That's better. Oh my goodness. And Gohemco said, anytime we need them to get our poo, give them a call. They'd be happy to come by and send a truck to pick up the poo. And that's really cool. I didn't know they would do that. I just thought we'd have to pay them every daggum time. But they said, nope. So just give us a call. We'll come and pick up your poo. Do we get the rest of it? Oh, I'm dro actually dropping some. As if it wasn't dropped already. Because <laughs> they're... It's poo. They're, they're droppings. Shut up. I'm funny. <laughs> Alright. Let's get this done. Let's get this put away. And uh, we're going to be cleaning everybody up once in the morning and once in the evening. Uh, you really don't have to clean much more than that. If you guys have animals, don't think that you have to do like just constantly baby the animals. I know it says like, oh, if you don't, you know, if you don't clean them out, the productivity is going to go down. It's not going to go down that fast. And two, if you, <laughs> it, it almost it it makes me giggle so much um, because the way it scares you into thinking that you have to just if you do animals in seasons, that's all you can do is just animals and that's it. Um, there's so much more that you can do. You don't have to just do a whole bunch of animals. There we go. All right. Let me get this moved out of the way so I can drop off his bucket. Cool. Now, I mentioned in the previous episode that I was interested in buying a new farm. Or not farm. Not a new farm. A, uh, a new... What do you call those things? Fields! Yes! I knew that. I knew that, you knew that, ha ha ha, we both knew that together. Look at us knowing things together. We're so good at this. And I had seen a few that I liked. Obviously, 53 down at the bottom. 34 was another one because the price wasn't that bad. And I was like, well, it may be. Because it's right here at the farm. It's big, so we're going to get a good... Good harvest on it. Honestly, if we get 34, I'll probably make that the grass field. And we'll take 30 and 38. And we will pull those up and put some real crop in those. But I I did decide, at least for right now, we're just going to keep, keep what we've got. Keep the money that we've got. Can we raise any wheels up? Yes, but only the back one. That one's weird. Uh, and we go open the doors. Wing, wing, wing. <laughs> All right. Let's get this put away. And I'm not really sure if there's much more that we have to do today other than just taking care of the animals. Eh, we'll find out. 
One thing that you all know is that I am an idiot. See the top where it says maintenance required? Well... Yeah, I might have accidentally forgot to take um, pretty much everything yesterday in game. I didn't need it. Um, but yeah, you see there's a lot of tire tracks going through here. Uh, this is the last thing that needs maintenance, though. Interesting enough. And it was the most expensive by far. Goodness gracious. I've sold a few things, just little things like... A couple bell forks sitting around that I bought, but now that I've got the JCB, will likely never use ever again. Some things like that. Turn that off. Turn the help window off. Bada bing. Bada boom, baby. Yeah, yeah. Um, let's grab this guy. Oh, we don't really need to if we're just walking over here. So you probably remember back about mid-year, this was a full area. Well, not so full anymore. See, there's only a weight, two buckets, and a front loader in here now. Which is crazy. We've gotten rid of so much stuff from that. But not only have we gotten rid of stuff, we've replaced stuff as well. And through replacing stuff we actually need to grab this this is the tractor that goes technically with all that stuff we need to get some stuff moved around and, and kind of put in different places because this area in here will soon be used for some other stuff what I can't say yet I want it to be a surprise but regardless we do have stuff in here that needs to move and I believe I'm going to move everything that's in here. Even the rear weight. Let's see if we can pick it up. Can we do it? Beep, beep, beep. Got it. Oh, brakes on this thing suck. So we pretty much got everything taken care of and moved around, done. Things are where I want them to be. Trailers where I want them to be. And it's coming together. It's coming together really nicely. One thing I will say is at the end of this year, we're going to have to expand the yard because we're running out of places to put things. So the way we're going to do that is we're going to get two big... Uh, I think we're going to get two. We may get more than that. But we're going to get two big uh, sheds. We're going to put them right here. Now, because I'm putting them there... Obviously, this field is going to have to get smaller. So what I'm going to do is we're going to get a roller. We're going to line up and go straight down. So that from here over will be field. But from here this way will all be new. Well, be new farmyards, what it'll be. And we're going to put some stuff. I'm not sure if they're going to be open or closed. But we're going to put some stuff over there. Hopefully give us some extra space, and that's also where we're going to put bales as well. That way this area right here doesn't have to be there, because it doesn't look right there. At least I don't think it looks right, and I don't like it. And, and what I say goes. <laughs> now the weight's not going in here, however the buckets and the front loader are going in here. I gotta be able to see, Dan, I can't even see in here. Uh, let's back it up just a little bit. Back it up. Can't see. Drop it down. Drop it. Does it have a front weight on it, too? <laughs> it does have a front weight on it. Well, at least it's balanced now. Front weight, back weight, you know, all that good stuff. So, what do you guys think about the new addition to the farmyard over there? Let me know down in the comments section. Say, yes, that's definitely what we want. No, we do not want you to do that. We want that area to be the same. But here's the thing that you may not be thinking about. Because I'm going to take that area out and we're done with this so we can close this. Because we're making a new area over here, we're gonna have some area that we're not gonna have filled on anymore. We're gonna have to make up for that. 
So not only are we going to do all that, we're going to buy another field. And I'm guessing just drop? Yes. Yes, indeed. Okay, let's put this down and let's push these forward. Let's back up until we can't anymore. Drop the front loader. There we go. Now the weight's got somewhere else it's going to go, but that is where those are going. At least for now. The weight is going to go in the shop. And now you're thinking, <laughs> what? <laughs> Why would you put the weight in the shop? Well, I got a place I want to put it. I want to put it right here. Let's lower it down so it doesn't just like plop and fall. There we go. Teddy. <laughs> Let's roll them around. I do have time set on times 15 right now. Just to kind of give us a little bit of, I wouldn't say help, but. You know, it's we don't need to go that crazy with it. So this is done. This area is done. Everything's cleaned up. Everything's good. The cedars we don't really need. The next thing we're going to use, honestly, is that the not the cultivators, the combines. The combines are the next thing we're going to use. Let's check our aminals. How we doing? Where are they? Cleanliness eighty three percent. Health seventy nine percent. Manure, 540 already. Just in the past few hours. Goodness gracious. We might be calling the Goham Co. and being like, Hey, so we need a bigger bucket. <laughs> that might be a thing that we got to do. Yeah, look at all that in there. That is nasty, janky nasty. Ooh, I have to come through and clean that out. Again, like I said... The plan is only to clean out, um, well, I guess maybe about every eight hours. So, why am I going this way? Wait. There's a... Is he telling me we don't even need that thing? hey ba da chirk bark dirk 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 All right. Thank you, Gohemco, for sending another truck. We really appreciate it. I'm stupid. You're not. <laughs> they actually sent me a newer version of that man truck that they had. Pretty cool. I do like this one. What do you think? I kind of dig this one. So we've got two, kind of two different versions. And we have added lights. Wow, yep, that one's bright. Let's get this done. Huh. Thank you, Gohamco. We appreciate you, brah. <laughs> what they're gonna do is they're gonna... Ooh, and this one turns better too. They have said that they would be cool coming and picking this up and dumping it for us since we're stupid. And the thing is, now, instead of coming and taking this when it's full, we're going to have to figure out what the bucket. But it's alright. That's what this area right here is for. Let's see. Can we get the sun to work with us? Which direction is the sun coming from right now? Let's see. That's north. Which means the sun rose there and is setting there. And judging by everything, it is already setting. Crepamundo. Is that a little too bright? It seems a little bright. Let's turn that off. It seems a little too dark. Yeah. How about if we hop up here? Nope. <laughs> Trying to get a good picture. Let me just let me up. Meow. And run. <clears throat> nope. How did I get up over here? Did I, or am I just... You know what? I don't even care. I'm not going to get this as a picture. 
All right. Thank you, Gohemco, for bringing us a truck and coming and picking up the, the thing for us. We, we really appreciate you. All right. <laughs> Back at it. In hindsight, the way we were doing it was probably the better way to do it. But we got a manure thing, so we might as well plop it there. All right. Let's take a little trip, shall we? Let's take a little journey. So we all know that these fields down here, we have replanted barley again in them. However, soon these will just be grass fields. As soon as this, uh, as soon as this turnover is done, we will make these grass fields. Sorry. <laughs> they were OG grass fields. We we're just trying to get them back to the way they were. So let's bump our speed up maybe to about 30 now. Ooh, a little quick. I'm not sure we'd be going 30 miles an hour through the woods. Oh, yeah. So we got some stumps here. Oh, yeah. Stump grinder. So we got this whole area up here. Let's see if we can get to it without. All right. I know it's a trail, but we're going to gun it anyway. Go, 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 go. How fast can we get? How fast can we get? Can we get top speed? No. Dangerous. Ooh. Taking a corner. 50 miles an hour on grass. We are crazy. We got stumps to cut. And we want to cut them down before the grass gets too long. Now we got a stump here. Stump there, stump here, and one here. I believe that's everything. It would also be kind of nice to put some fences up or something to keep this looking nice, but I know trying to get those fences set up and everything, they're a little chore, so I'm not going to worry about the fences right now, but we do need to get these stumps cut. To do this job and to make it look super cool, we're going to come in here. Let's go ahead and repair, customize. Engine's good. We want rear twins. Uh, forestry. And that's it. Oh, yeah. Bam! Oh, and we want that weight back. <laughs> Give me the weight! Now, this is way, uh, way overkill for the job that we need to do. It looks so cool, doesn't it? Oh, yeah. Yeehaw! I love it. Oh, man, I love it so much. The only thing I'm worried about, and I'm just thinking about this, is these duels being on here about destroying the crop down there. Um, you know, I'm going to chance it. I don't know why I put this forestry thing on here. It's, it's a cage match between Farmer John in the Messy Ferguson 698T. Yeah, who's gonna win? <laughs> Yo, can we even fit through here with duels on here? Yeah, we can. All right, sweet. <laughs> I know I'm an idiot. I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry. You know, I love it. There we go. If we go over that now, we are gonna kill it. But, funny enough, we only destroy the, the, ga or the grass I was about to say gas, not gas, the grass. Young counter number one. Now we only destroy the grass down to its next to last state. Well, guess what state it's in? It's in a pretty good state right now. There are a few here that I want to handle. This one is a big one right here. Oh, yeah. That's gone. And then there's another one right up here. Right there. This bad boy. Bad boy, dang it! Bad boys, bad boys! What you gonna do? What you gonna do when DJ Goham doesn't quit saying bad boys? <laughs> Alright, we got those. And then we got some more in the woods. Ba -dum -da -dum. Cha -cha 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 -cha. <laughs> Got some triggered memories of uh, Wilker Farms doing that. There we go. There's one. 
Oh yeah, here's this, here's another one. I totally forgot about this one. There we go. You know, funny enough, for I think it's just the mods that are difficult to use through here because the in-game stuff seems to be working just fine. And you can see this is working just fine. I have my lights on. We don't need our lights on. There we go. Got that. And now I got another one over here. Let's go move that. This is just a piece. I'm not sure if it's gonna chop that up or not. Yes, it is. Cool. Is it just the one? I think it's just the one. Here we can uh, take a snapshot of this and, and say, finally, <laughs> we're finally doing it. Here we go. All right, let me kind of get this lined up just right there. And... Some of it's chopped down anyway. Oh no, we turned the whole thing off then. Let's turn it down, let's put that there. And if we're gonna be like this. Yeah, that'll look cool. Always looking for the best possible thing. And smile and say cheeseburger, my dog. Cheeseburger. Got him. Last one. This is it. This is it. We're getting this done. And I'm digging it. Oh, man. We now have a very nice area to go through where we don't have to worry about any more stumps. We could just drive straight through to get all of our bells sold. So that is going to be it. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please drop a like. If you've not already, please subscribe. And I hope you guys have a great day. We'll see you later. Peace.